Hello everybody, Half-Life Gaming here. I'm here to show you guys how to install the Half-Life Resurgence because I know people have problems with uh, getting that. So what you want to do is you want to get go to GitHub and you want to make an account if you haven't already. And then you want to search up Half-Life Resurgence. Go into it. Go to code. And hit download zip. And then after you hit download zip, you want to hit open file in the corner. Copy it. And then after that, you're going to want to go to... It will say Windows, a couple of letters, and I'll have on like on the side of it. If you kind of tilt your head, it looks like a smiley face or like a winky face. Go into that. Steam. Steam apps. And then after that. Oh wait. And then common, I think it says. And then after that. It, you go to Gary's Mod. And after that, click Gary's Mod again, click Add-ons, and then paste it into there. After it's done loading, you're also going to need to get VJ Base off of GitHub. You're going to need the GitHub version of VJ Base for the GitHub and PC. So you're going to want to go to him because he's the one that made both VJ Bases. Go to here and do the same thing you did. As a matter of fact, since this is the base, uh, so that way no errors happen, I kind of recommend you download this first. I will put two links, one link going straight over to here, one link going to the other one. I don't know if you can download code without logging in, but Yes, we'll see. Okay, you guys can test it for me and check it out. Because I've never tried doing that. I've always logged into here. In fact, I'm going to have to update this because I haven't updated it in a few days. So yeah, apparently there's a shock trooper fix. But, um, yeah, this was just a short video, and this is also the video I was going to do without, uh, without, before doing Half-Life Resurgence related videos. I'm going to be doing its own video for each and every single one of them. And it's going to be a long ride, but we're going to have to do it. Now, for Half-Life Resurgence, since I had some Half-Life 2 NPCs, but most of them are Half-Life 1, I'm only going to be doing the Half-Life 1 today, into like, what, maybe 5 or 6 parts, because of how many NPCs there are. Do it in one video, trim it down. But, after that, then the next day will be the Half-Life 2 that comes with it. And then the Half-Life 2 expansion pack. And we're going to be comparing both Half-Life 2 and the Half-Life 2 expansion packs together. And then after that we have Crack Life NPCs. Apparently it's like a Half-Life mod that's like really silly and stupid. And then after that we have the Quake, Condition Zero, Deleted Scenes, Heart of Evil, and then the Half-Life Zombie Edition. I've messed around with Zombie Edition, but I haven't really checked out any of these other ones. But yeah, I've, I'm pretty excited to check these out. I've only checked out really the Half-Life one, 
related ones because I'm honestly more into that game than the rest of them. Oh, and also, and there's an extra tab. If you can hear, there's an HD tab for HD related NPCs. There's only a few of them. I've seen it before. There's only like HD Gargantua, HD Baby Gargantua, and then they have all the military, and then they have an alien grunt, an alien slave, and that's literally it. They don't have any scientists, they don't have any, I mean they do technically have an HD scientist if you go into the zombie edition, but anyways, enough of me blabbering, I'm done. I'll see you guys later. When I post up the um, uh, Half Life Resurgence video, and I hope this helped someone. I will type it up in the description of how to do it because some people can listen to people's words. You can't watch how I'm doing it because for some reason I can't record whilst being in my folder. If I were to do that, then the video would have just cut off and I would have had to delete this whole six minute video so far. Um, but yeah, aside from that, I will post a description of what exactly you're supposed to be finding and looking for of course this is for people who have steam and this is for people who already have gary's mod so all you have to do is sign up on github it's free it's pretty easy to do it only takes a few minutes and then after that uh it should only take a few minutes to install both of the files that you're trying to get it should take a few minutes for half-life resurgence though because it's kind of a big mod there's like over 30 npcs with a whole bunch of contributors shout outs to all of them you all are amazing every last one of you Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and get off this video, and I guess I'll see you guys when I post up the Half-Life Resurgence, uh, Half-Life 1 video, into like, I don't know, 30 parts or something, because they've made like 100 NPCs, I'm not even kidding, they made like every Half-Life NPC, the only thing they didn't put in here so far that I've noticed is they didn't decide to add like a Gordon Freeman scientist or they didn't add like a Gordon Freeman player animated <laughs> like AI NPC they could have done that I'm not gonna complain or anything because honestly I don't think this really needs that I mean come on they've added probably well over half of a half-life official NPCs and they even added cut ones and alpha ones to check out so yeah I'm very excited for it I just realized I've been recording for like 10 minutes with me just blabbering on bye and stay tuned